And we're still in here? Alright. Well, though... We can try and go through that trap, though. Just don't touch the egg on the way. <laughs> the egg's dangerous. And now we have the lighter, so we can light all the other candles in the place. Okay. That is collectibles. No worries. Uh, we still can't get far. And now is our chance to just run for the stage while there's no one in there. If it's not this trap door, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Yeah. Oh, where are we off now? The basement? Get in, nothing bad ever happens in the basement. Oh, a painting of sunflowers. Their petals are turned inwards like teeth. Nice. Oh, it's like the sucky fish's face. Alright, where are we going? I kind of like the speed exploring. It's fun. <laughs> so we've got to try and find a clock down here, I'm sure. A book called The Killer 7 catches your eye. The illustrations have an unusual art style. The Killer 7. I like that. Ooh. Collection of stories about talking animals. Playing card has been used as a bookmark. I will take that. They will never know where they were in that story again. Okay. Uh, painting of a dragon. It was drawn by a master expressionist or a very small child. Easy to get... That looks too good. That... There's nothing wrong with that picture. <laughs> what are you talking about, game? Uh oh. Don't freeze on me. Oh, is this the cellar trap door thing that we've seen through the vent? Figures for everything sold at the bar. In the bar. Oh, like numbers, not action figures. There seems to be two sets of ledgers. These two barrels smell off. Maybe the ale went bad. Or maybe it's poisoned. Have we seen anyone get poisoned yet? Yeah, this is exactly where I thought we would end up. Enough beer to drown a small army. Unless they're northerners, in which case it's enough <laughs> for a morning's refreshments. I told you Richie is here. Um... Selection of wines are extraordinary. It would be a struggle to find a single bottle worth less than hundreds, if not thousands of pounds. So much expensive stuff. Aha. Found a secret door to the bar. Map updated. So we can now get around... Around one of the doors. Um, which door? It's one of the doors in here has a padlock on. I'm not sure which one, but somewhere over here. Uh, we're now back in the main. Where are we in the main building? Okay, okay, okay. Thanos, the blueprint prince, and oh, it's that Aurum guy. Who made the bell? Alright, I've got to save these two. Oh, it's the big dude! Right, I know roughly where he goes, at least. Empty keg of what smells like brandy and some knocked over stools. Might well be related. Makes sense. Okay, we need to light the candle in here. I don't remember what time people come in here. Right, talk to me. Don't just sing! What are you doing? Oh my god. Oh, I know what to do. 
What are you gonna sing to now? I think Richie is all of these ghosts. All the drinks here have amazing names and have poison in. Did I mention that? We kind of figured that one out. Welcome to the bar, friend. Every cocktail we serve here is made with a different variety of venom. Just a drop, mind you. But it gives the drinks a kick like you wouldn't believe. The marquee is a connoisseur's connoisseur when it comes to freaky drinks. All these creatures here, everyone's venom adds a different flavour. <laughs> Richie is here! We summoned the Richie. Look, you're definitely a pirate ghost at a poisonous bar, right? <laughs> There's also barrels of beer enough to drown a small army unless they're not... You're not northern though, really, are you? You're midland. But, you know, whatevs. You're an honorary northerner. <laughs> Um, all these creatures- yeah, yeah, I've read that. And down in the casino, the thing he's been growing there, I mean, wow, it's l All right, I think you've had quite enough. Ooh, what have they been growing in the casino? Have we seen that? Um... I mean, we need to- right, we need to go down there anyway, because there's a chest and an urn. We need to be breaking open some urns. They're growing something down here. Or maybe that's some fish tanks down there, I don't know. He's northern to southerners, that's true. Oh, proud to be an honorary northerner. That's... that's a word that's difficult to say, by the way. Uh, um, let's go and talk to Richie number five. Password? No, I don't know. No, don't know it. I didn't think so. We need a password to get back through. Fine. What happens if I put the music back on? Maybe he'll just dance and let me through. Richie, don't you dare be an asshole. You've got to let me through. So now he's just singing and I'm still not... Oh, still not allowed through. It, it's the guy that we need to follow. Oh, God. I also want to go through here. Oh, there's someone out there. Oh, fuck. I'm going exactly the way that he's going. Oh, I can I can wait in here. <laughs> Password equals not guilty. <laughs> Is the password a bottle of beer? I think that would work too, yeah. He's coming, I can hear his footsteps. As overwhelming as the game audio can be. I think it's really done well. It's kind of crucial to the gameplay. Okay, so he likes to gamble. We've got a ghost in there. And then he go doesn't he go and argue with the woman? Oh, hello. You look like a man of taste. Are you headed to the main library? Would you see if you can find a decent... Find me a decent mystery. Something devilishly tricky. A real noodle scratcher. If you happen to find such a thing, would you bookmark it for me? Here, use this. Oh, cheers! That'll keep me going for a while. Cheers, friend! Right, there's the door that I was thinking of. All right, so we can't actually go through that door. But we can open this. Sneak in, see if there's anything in there. 
Ooh. Oh, this is the library. First edition of Grayson's Grayson's All Biography. Treasure Hunter. He just loves those eggs. Um, Trinity. Collected sculptures. The Braille version. Nice. Songs by Tequila Bell. The case contains smudged diagrams from an enormous golden cloth. Encyclopedias. I mean, I'm sure the ghost could puzzle over an encyclopedia. Tomes on everything from history to poetry. Where are we right now on the map? Okay. Oh. Mall library. Copy of the mask. A faded parchment, barely legible at the top. Japanese characters for the black hair. Oh, collectibles. Hotchi the earless. We can definitely smash that light up above. The table is right underneath the chandelier above. Right, we need to smash that. Charles Joseph Carter. No idea who that is. Juju Guppy. Oh, a report on the fisherman who caught a Juju Guppy but later drowned himself. Is that the anglerfish? Um, time to absolutely not bookmark it. We are keeping that collectible, hell yeah. Oh no, we're gonna run out of time. Books are crammed into every inch of the tall cases. Right. How do we get up the stairs though? There are no stairs. I need to get... Before we run out of time. Hmm. Oh, there's a door to the right. That I didn't even see. I don't have time to look through. <laughs> Just go. Aha. Stairs. How looks for the library. Shit. We haven't looked in that bookshelf. Run. I have no idea how this would link around. Ah, it's so big. All right, we're now on the top floor again. <laughs> Oh! And it links by that corridor there that I think we couldn't get through at this end. He's another... I bet this is like a shortcut or something, like... Wait. Can we... Can we... No, don't pass out. That door over there, I just want to know if it can open. All oh, right, no, it's it's fiery. Wasn't there a secret in the library? Nothing so far is very secret. -y. No, I thought he was just saying he wanted like a puzzly book. <laughs> I'm not sure now. Okay, right, we can just we can run straight out. We could have also right next time we're going straight for a clock so that we can reset where we begin didn't think of that. Wait, where am I? Oh, the trapdoor. A certain shelf and went into the room but then said, oh wait, this is not the library. That was, that was part of this puzzle. That's where the electricity fuse box was behind the, the bookshelf in the switch room. Yeah, so that was... where are we? So this is the theatre with the... Sp there's the spiky cage thing. I thought this room on... like this in the centre there, I thought that was the library. Because the ghost said there's something hidden in the library. So I went in here and there was nothing. But he was actually talking about this room up here. Which is not a library at all. Oh, there's a chest in there. Oh, can't get back up. Oh shit, no. So... I don't want to reset the clock yet if I want to go back in there. Do you know what? I'm going to restart the day and I'm going to go and grab that other chest. <laughs> I'm sure it'll all open up at the end. Maybe. 
But while I'm here, I might as well... I want to go and look in the chests. Right, there's a chest directly to the left. I want to know if they're all just collectibles or if there's other little trinkets or like anything that helps with gameplay. It's like, also there's this key that we found that we don't know where that goes yet. That um, has like dice on it. This chest is an ornament. Fuck. <laughs> don't these... Those mirrors look like they'll be shortcuts. <laughs> that pretty much describes just me playing anything, Giraffe. <laughs> okay, we're going up and right. Completely to the other end of the board. This does feel a bit Cluedo-esque. Like, this would be a fun Cluedo game with multiplayer. I did call it that someone was going to be getting electrocuted. This chest isn't... Oh, fuck. This chest isn't a chest either. The game's trolling me. Right. That isn't a chest. We've done... Oh, the ones that you can interact with have a circle around them. Okay. There's nothing else with a white outline, so I'm gonna reset the day again. <laughs> and then I'm gonna go to another clock. You can't call the things you are going to do yourself. <laughs> it wasn't me! I didn't electrocute anybody! <laughs> no, I won't have it. All these accusations on this poor little innocent person. It's bullying. <laughs> right, where's the nearest clock? Resetting time. We just resetted. We're going to we're going to the bar. Wait, where are we? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> bar. I knew that you would like that. Bit. Just need to take a drink. Oh, this is this was your this is what made me think of you, Richie. Do you like it? <laughs> oh, fuck. Sorry, friend. So we don't know how they die, yeah? <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> oh, we can't even spy through this. What kind of a door doesn't have a spy hole? Would you dare have a door without a spy hole? Oh yeah, I can listen. What did these ghosts tell us again? There's definitely something important. Yeah, I'm gonna do... Wait, did I even go through here? I didn't, did I? I didn't even peek. Because then I got interrupted by Thanos. Um, when it's a jar. <laughs> Sorry, different jaw. <laughs> oh, Richie. Uh, you are funny. <laughs> right, the garden. Yep, yep. All the gardens are nice. I get it. Now let me around here, please. Thank you. 
I think there's 52 cards, right? Oh, we've got we've got more infos. Guest rooms. Hungry law. We did this ages ago. When Willow Blue discovered the Marquis had suffered successfully obtained an actual juju guppy, she was filled with dread. Far from being a colourful superstition, these ancient demons will sometimes take the form of a tiny fish in order to get close to people of influence <laughs> or who have a lot to lose. I know how to infiltrate the highest of governments. Take the form of a tiny fish. <laughs> never fails. Though she never speaks of it, Willow is a true voodoo princess, blessed or cursed with the second sight. Knowing the danger, the guppy paused. Willow created a powerful lock to the secret chamber where the Marquis had hidden the fish so that no one could ever enter by accident. The lock will only open to the collect correctly prepared charm. Thankfully, she just left that lying around with instructions. The theater brutal. All right, the switch rooms. The Marquis is, is a passionate supporter and enthusiast for theater and art. Also, he's an enormous show off and loves nothing more than excessive displays of wealth and passion. For the most recent stage production featuring enormous gilded, featuring an enormous gilded cage, he arranged for thousands of volts of electricity to be rerouted into the theater as a token nod to some as a token nod to some form of he health and safety. <laughs> health and safety. <laughs> to activate the electricity, two fail safe switches must be flicked at the same time. But oh, that doesn't work when two fail safe switches also have to be switched to turn it off. That doesn't help with health and safety. <laughs> it's conceivable that the mechanism could be tampered with, meaning the same process would be needed to turn the electricity off. But the chances of that happening are surely too small to worry about. Hmm. <laughs> surely. Okay. I'm not entirely sure why I just opened the map there. Hmm. I wonder why this bit's so multi level. The water from the fountain is more soothing than you imagined possible. The magic fountain. Is this just the exit? Can we just leave? Leave them all to their death? There's no real path here, it's just the one tiny little house. Oh! Hello! Right, look, she's got a mirror that's not actually a mirror. And that looks like it, it's got the same design as the one in the theater area right so she's rocking the cradle but she's still got the baby in her belly can't get in there i have an option to use the lighter <laughs> okay that's not not the answer okay what is the symbol on the door, though? It's kind of like a fan? Maybe? Okay, let's just check the entire area. We're at the very top of the map here. We're definitely going to be coming back here at some point. That's for sure. I didn't use a clock! Ah! I need to go and use a clock! Where's the nearest clock? Oh god. Straight, straight, straight. Just a straight run. We can make it, we've got 
five hours? Something fell from the clock tower. <gasps> it's the invitation. Or is it her entire dead body? Oh wait, there's an arm on the floor. How do I get in there? Let me in! At least now we know what's directly underneath the clock tower, I guess. Please, no one. Oh, right, we're here. Mm. There we go. We definitely need to be around this area for that north. Oh yeah, and we can't get through that door. And I wonder if this is gonna open. Like, that looks like there should be a room in the middle there. Oh right, there's a door to it on that side. We have to go the long way around though. And there's... Right, he pulls on these, so these are something to do with his puzzle. 100%. All right, calm down. Can I just make it green again? Okay, that sounds positive. All right, this leads to that whole other area, right? Oh, we s how did I get in there before? This door here is locked. And that door down there is locked. But I've definitely been in there before. Or maybe I just... Oh, I peeked. I peeked. That's fine. There's a windy key. I guess... Let's go and look underneath the staircase at that bookshelf in case there was anything in there and see if we can get any further before we have to reset again. There's definitely a way up top there to that chandelier to smash it. A collection of horror stories, that's what we missed. <laughs> okay. We're gonna get reset anytime. Wait, Horatio Sixpence. Is that like Reginald's dad? Reggie's dad? Reggie the legend? Rough inks on handmade parchment. It's an unsettling effect. Painting is faded and scrubbed. And scratchy quality, you are unsure of the significance. I went in those two rooms, so I guess let's see what's in here. Aha! Bible is open at 2114 Proverbs. I don't really want to do it when the time's just about to run out. Someone has been researching the creation of a hungry charm. See? No point. Did that just release a candle? Because then, then we get to talk to the ghost in here. That's cool. We're heading straight for that this time. We might bump into someone on the way. How do we get there? Is a question. Also, I wonder if we were in the right place. At seven o'clock outside, if that's how we get Willow's invitation, like, because maybe we have to see where it falls. Um, all oh, right, yeah, we need to go through the secret door this way. Mm hmm. 
Oh, it's the staff. There is something wrong. The staff? Man, are you... Sh Shh, keep your voice down. It's like you said, we should talk to Lucas, but where is he? I don't know, maybe planning a big entrance? I mean, it's his big party, right? Please, just do as I ask. Okay, okay, I'll be there. But I can help you out and hope you're still wrong. All right, thanks. Red is safely tucked away in the theater. <laughs> you are sus, Mr. Cardman. Okay. Okay. Learning stuff. Now she's just chilling out in here. But oh no, Lucas should be here. Ah, my statues, the secrets you hide. Hmm. And where is Eleanor? I mean, we, I think we need to find more statues because it can't only be the two. But I'm... You know what? We should keep following her. It's also very suspicious. I don't like this at all. At least someone is, like, smart enough to notice. And then she has a conversation in here with someone. I remember spying on that. The staff here, they're different this year. This is all wrong. I trust Aurum, but not his judgment on the staff. Oh, God. Are you lost, sir? I know the man... Oh, fuck. Lost, lost. Oh, yeah, we've... this is what we've heard. Yep. Hmm. I want to see where they go. Looking for Lucas. I guess Lucas is... Yeah, Lucas is their employer. Maybe Lucas is the one that owns the entire place. Exaggerated looking at my watch, sir. <laughs> oh no, now this guy's Richie too. Oh god, like a situation. Oh my god. This, this is quite funny dialogue. Or perhaps, yeah, perhaps helping drag a body out of a chapel. Oh, so down here leads to the chapel area. Try not to die horribly while I'm gone. Okay. Right, but where do you go? Aurum. I hope you're taking this seriously. Well, are you not Aurum? Because you've got the same mask. Alright, so you're going down. And there's not there's no way that I can get there yet. Now we've got some rushing to do. I've left everything late. Straight to the top. Some rushing. <laughs> <laughs> Washing or whooshing? <laughs> oh god. What didn't I get? <laughs> oh, okay, okay, right, quickly. Now we gotta rush back down. Life is one big whoosh. <laughs> Oh dear. That painting on the left looks like a fall guy. I wasn't whooshing. I <laughs> I was reading Giraffe's comment about whooshing. Apparently when I say rushing, <laughs> it sounds like rushing, washing and whooshing. <laughs> Which is all a fair observation. Alright, Mr. Ghost. 
What have you got for me? The drivel in this library, I ask you. I mean, that shelf there. Handwritten, unpublished notes from some tiresome chap, Da Vinci, I think. That whole section over here? Some boring tit banging on about Ryman hypothesis. They've cracked. Yawn. Ooh, secret of the bookshelf. That bookshelf at the back? Oh, I think you um are on something crafty. I don't know what I missed. That bookshelf at the back. Pull the Balzac out. And the next shelf next to it moves. Health hazard, eh? Where is all the smut, sir? What are the illustrated geographical studies of disrobed... Where? <laughs> where? Are the illustrated geographical studies of disrobed tribes people? Where are the art books with the bosoms and the gentleman statues? <laughs> I find the lack of good old-fashioned obscenity to be completely indecent. I need a moment to myself. You do whatever you need to do. Goodbye, I never want to talk to you again. <laughs> Is this ghost just looking for nudes? Sir, this is a noob stream. You came to the wrong stream, I'm sorry. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Three pins. Show the left hand Cupid shooting an arrow through the central ball to impale the heart of the cherub on the right. These paintings are wittily placed. I, I don't see that. Makeshift altar. Through your sins, though your sins are like scarlet, they shall be as white as snow. The page has been ripped and scratched at. Oh, Bia, hello! Welcome! We are finding secrets. See? Secrets! Just to prove it to you, there's a secret. There are some occult looking preparations on the table underneath a diagram of what appears to be some kind of demon. Ah. We found the cult. Ah, here's a clock. Here's a clock. Wait, what did we just find here? We need a key though. But this is how we're gonna get... Oh, I know where the key is. We just gotta run straight for the key. Wait. Wait, what is this though? Oh! I didn't realize that was a door. Secrets. Okay. The best type of beer. What What was the best type of beer? I only remember talking about cults. <laughs> oh yeah. Secrets and also horny ghosts. That's true. <laughs> Wines. What do you mean there's no obvious way to wind the clock? What are you talking about? Oh no. As in every good mansion with full of secret passengers. Yep, there is a cult. Got here just right in time, you see. Yep. What did I whoosh now? This is the wrong clock. Heaven and hell winding key. Frig. We gotta find... Smell of decay and moss. Filled with pot. The heaven and hell staircase. Staircase? Clock? Where are you? Clock? Clock? Oh my god. There's a clock in this room? Where is it? We got it. Wind. And use. 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 No. Use. Okay. This is good. This is good. This is good. Oh, oh, beer is the best type of beer. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I missed. Maybe it's already wound? 
Otherwise, I've missed a key somewhere. No, it needs to be wound. It just told me that. All right, this is the secret way through here. Yeah. The level design's pretty good in this game. Books of scripture. I love these people just leaving cards everywhere. Okay. Is this clock puzzle some kind of wind up? <laughs> <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Tablet typing, not Richie Trunk. Cups. <laughs> um, almost every room in the mansion seems to have areas to sit and talk. What else would you fill your mansion with? Some of the cabinet is lined with felt like a roulette table. Well, the plants fill the room. I'm gonna... Mm, I'm always so excited as soon as there's new areas. Oh, look! I found the secret! And the other guys just wound the other thing. So there's two more of those statues to find. Okay. Was this room a waiting area? Waiting for what? That does sound ominous. A masked girl weeping over dice. That was me <laughs> in Disco Elysium. Um, oh good, every cult mansion needs some demon books. Yep. Oh fuck, I've done it again. Why is everyone so creepy in this world? <laughs> it's the hip way that poorly sighted middle-aged honorary northerners do. I'm glad I read that as honorary and not just horny like how I read it in my head the first time I read it. <laughs> um, a dark mask over pale marble. The statue emanates pure white hot grief. It's hard to be near. Oh, the guy's in there. Okay, let's go in here. We can just get this. That's a door? They were looking through that with their eyes, I'm sure. Ah, I found another statue. Okay. Hmm. Oh god, I'm trapped. <laughs> yeah, Giraffe is a cool master. <laughs> Richie's like, no. Painting, he has a clear set of peepholes where the eyes would be. There's something blocking the other side. Oh god, which... They go down now, so then I can sneak out here and go through that door. <laughs> yeah, no, don't be impolite. I'm sorry. <laughs> First horny ghost, now horny northerners. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, okay. Please take a seat. Death will be right with you. That's exactly what that waiting room was for. <laughs> right. Would you please mind... Hurrying up a little bit so I can come into this room. Thank you, please. We can also now follow them. But we can also do that next time. I'd rather go in the secret room. No, let me in! <laughs> Secrets. Oh. So this is this is where the peeping thing is. Peepholes going to the eyes. It's possible to see through the other side. Hmm. 
Well, you're not gonna let me peep? You can't just so show someone a peephole and then not let them peep, you know? The eyeball painting is quite something. Oh yeah, I see it. <laughs> Place cards. Tequila Bell and Widow Blue. Willow. Not Widow. <laughs> Willow. Clay Rockridge and Trini Carrington. Clay and Trini, husband and wife. The Magicians, Grayson and Red. These are the two we've got to save now. Me and Eleanor. And Buzz and Bonds or Bondus or whatever, the name of Lucas, the owner of the thing. Were they planning to just murder all of us with poisoned cocktails? Because I kind of think they were. Pee or peep? <laughs> peep! <laughs> no, this is clearly the peep -pee side, not the peeper. Really? Oh! Clearly. <laughs> Not to be confused with the PP. Yeah. <laughs> Let's just aim a bit. <laughs> Aha. So we can peep on this meal, but we're invited to the meal. Hmm. What kind of banquet room allows guests to spy on some random back room? <laughs> I don't know. It had curtains, so that's why I thought it was just... <laughs> oh, the white keys on the piano are carved from... Skimeter Oryx Horn. The black keys are... Bot Bostami Turtle Shell. This is not an animal friendly place. Needle sharp spines, the cactus. The arm is missing. I did see an arm outside. Oh, I got the hiccup -y burps. Hold on then. Okay, we're kind of exploring the entire area around. Let's go in the smaller rooms before we go in the bigger room. Ooh, uh, but as for the cowardly, the faithless, the detestable, the murderers, their time will be forever in the lake of blood that burns with fire and sulfur, which is the death eternal. Not me. Not my fate. I hope. Skeletal image is mesmerized and haunting. You can't quite get it out of your head. It's got hair. I wouldn't worry about the night. He's armless. <laughs> oh god. Don't boo. <laughs> He's just trying to save face. He loved it. Behind the curtains is just a blank wall. Perhaps there were doorways that were sealed up. Ah, because there's a curtain in another room that looks like it would be a doorway as well. So that one needs an arm. We can now go into this big room. Oh no, we cannot. Oh, shit's going down. It does. Oh no. Oh no. Like, I know I just arrived at the time the incinerator turned on, but I swear it wasn't me. Oh, Thanos. Oh, no. Oh, boy. Hmm. I guess we need to make all the things green to stop that from happening. No, <laughs> Shadow, I did not murder someone. <laughs> oh, no, but the stench of burnt flesh is filling the air. That doesn't mean I murdered anyone though. Oh fuck, I didn't mean to go up there. Oh, there's an upper layer to this level too? I'm overwhelmed. He's not even looking at me, no! <laughs> no, I didn't! 
Paintings are uniformly bizarre and unsettling. The room is a glorious visual nightmare. No! It's okay. Because we respawn right here. Does she sell Sanctuary? That's my cult reference that you're probably too young for. <laughs> Which cult is that? Don't all cults sell Sanctuary? <laughs> Hmm, okay. You were pretending to boo. It seemed appropriate. I see. Oh, there's the scully man. That leads... Right, okay. I haven't quite gotten the area down here figured out yet. Oh, this is a dog. Fuck! Without a people. And there must be a secret door in here. Oh, no, I can't get in. Oh, the mirror. He definitely te teleported through the mirror. A beautifully crafted mirror. Again, there is a haunting sense of being watched. Actually, this mirror looks very similar to the one that was in the pregnant lady's thing. Don't give me that music, game. Don't do it. If we sing loud enough, maybe we can blow their eardrums so they don't know where to look for us. The blue oyster cult <laughs> goes back into my middle-aged corner. Oh. oh, there's something with these mirrors. Right, at least we can get out here now. Got a whole nother level to look at. Or oh, just a room, maybe. Two cards in one room. Ah, and this is... Oh, we've been up there on the other side of this. All right. Yep, yep. Feel like we're kind of getting to a point where we've been everywhere. This is the heaven and hell staircase. Like the school man went in here and he was gone. We've done the urn. Wait, there's a room up... Well, there's a secret room up there if I'd ever seen one. Now it's time to do some stalking, I think. Wait, that I look a lot like an N in that high quality cult. <laughs> what? <laughs> what do you mean? Monument of a phoenix. That's why it burns. We do need to see what happens in here. Where do people come from? Oh. <gasps> They're gonna come in here soon. They come through this door. After the gunshot, that's right. We're just gonna chill in this cupboard for a little bit and see what happens. That L. What? That, I, that, oh, that L look a lot like an N in that high quality cult. The... Blue Oyster Cult. The Blue Oyster Cult. <laughs> Wait, no. Oh no! <laughs> Nailed it, didn't I? <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> That's some high quality motion. <laughs> okay, well this guy's setting up the incinerate. No, he's not. He's going upstairs. <gasps> There's two of them. But we really need to follow this person around. Say nothing. <laughs> Stop talking! <laughs> oh no. Even Ross is like, shut up. This statue holds a deep secret. Lucas asked me to put secret mechanisms in place years ago. As long as those me mechanisms are still in place, 
Stomach statues. 9.50, the way will open. Right. Where are you, Aurum? I don't like weighing out in the open here. Don't come down the stairs. I would like to get out of this cupboard. Did you see the way he barged through that door? Oh no, now she's praying to a skeleton. Oh hey. These pies have always been extraordinary. But something is very wrong here. You're the only one with any sense. Maybe this mask will just give us some sense. Oh, she hasn't gone. He hasn't gone. They haven't gone yet. And the staff. Why does no one else see it? And why would we be kept from parts of the mansion? Why haven't we built you a secret elevator in the first place, Lucas? Damn it. Aurum is getting... Aurum, it's getting close. If you set all four statues to spades, then my monument is about to crack open and we can continue the search. I know you don't believe we're in any danger. I hope you are right. Spades. All right. Lucas, what has happened here? Are you coming? Oh. 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 I trusted you and worked with you to create a mansion and allow secrets to be kept. What secrets have you hidden from me, my boy? Oh, so it's, it's the other one I need to turn. I hope you know what you're doing. I don't need to get them all green. I need to make them none of them green. Oh, that's Aurum? I thought you were Thanos. Did you manage to change the statues? No, look, you can clearly see that he hasn't changed that one. <laughs> oh, no. I think it's the one in the entryway. I know you're still struggling to believe me, but this will work. Did you change all four statues? The bar, the library, the piano room here, and the entrance... The bar... Hold on. The bar, the library... The bar... Uh... The bar... The bar, the bar, the bar... The entrance hall... The bar, the library... And something else. We know there's one there, the entrance hall. The, we didn't see one in the library. Hmm. Yeah, they are drawn on the map. <laughs> Richie Bar. Something is very wrong. We don't usually get inducted into a delf death call at a dinner party. <laughs> a delf cut. Um, does that room below the library count as a library? Ah, maybe this one. Hmm. Engine's Hall must have missed that one. Yeah, I knew it was the entrance hall one that needed changing. Ah, it opened. So, on the next one, we can do that. I did like you asked. Can't believe it worked. What did you say this thing... It was part of the old furnace system. Furnace? What the hell are we doing climbing into a furnace, man? <laughs> it's all been disconnected. Lucas had me create an entirely new and highly efficient... Oh, they both go in there. <laughs> I did hear it. <laughs> This guy is noob, yep. Okay. Right, 
we can't go in just yet. There was no invitation in here. It must have got burned. How inconvenient. I wonder if there's a way that we can kill some of them so that their invitation doesn't get me messed up. So... What happens if we change it now? How do we get round there is a good question. So I think on the next day we need to go straight to the entrance hall, put it on spades. And then I would like to go into this courtyard bit here for 7 o'clock. No, I'm not planning on killing people. I'm saving them. <laughs> I also, there's so much I still want to do. I need to go back to the... the dressing room up here. I need to go and find the glass that I can smash. There's definitely chests around that I want to open. Not up there, down here somewhere. Yeah, I need to go down here to the casino. I might go and do some of that stuff first. What time is it right now? Ah, we're resetting any second. This is the one with the broken arm, but it's okay because it's set on spades. Ooh. Oh, so when we want to look through this, we need to have gone in there first to open the curtains. Damn. I don't know when they'll be in there though. Maybe that's on the final loop. When if we save everyone, but also we would be in there too. So I don't know. Right, we're running somewhere. The laws of physics. What did they do now? <laughs> so rude, not let you see through solid objects. <laughs> I mean, we could blow the curtains out of the way, maybe. Oh, there's a secret door to let us back through quicker. That's right. Wait, no, we don't need it. Oh. Oh, that's fine. Oh, we can do that now, just in case we need it. Just in case, you never know when you need to peep. Curtains <laughs> waft and open randomly, very unsuspicious. Exactly, no one would suspect a thing. <laughs> I always find it really fun when they leave things in levels for you to go back to get. Right, we've got to be careful because we know that the other guy's walking around. Oh, there's one that... Oh, he's coming this way. There's one that he hasn't changed yet, but he's gonna change. And that'll be spades. I'm still curious, if there was three, what would happen if we made them all green? Well, I can't find the, the fourth one, but I feel like that's a secret. He transformed into another person! What the heck? Bonus prize, immediate murder. <laughs> oh wait, was this who was in there all along? I thought it was the other dude. I think I mistook who I saw. <laughs> I was a bit stressed by the scary mask. Okay, uh, I do want to go through there. Oh god, it's seven o'clock. Let's go down here first. Oh. See, wouldn't you think the green was good? Like, it's just tricking you? That's quite funny. So that's spades. And then I just want to... Well, I want to hang out there at 7, but before then, maybe... 
I can make it to where? Where did I want to go? I wanted to go down to the casino. That's something to do in, in a single day, I would guess. And I wanted to go up the stairs. I don't think there's time. Let's just hang out here. This is where... This is directly below the clock tower. So I, I need to see what happens. At seven. So we got some time. That's only the first murder. We've still got to wait for three more hours. <laughs> I'm sorry about that. Hold on, I've got a new thing. Oh. Oh, Thanos' architect insight. Is this going to let us go through those doors? Because that would make everything a lot easier. Heaven and Hell's staircase, the Hell Room. The Hell Room was one of two rooms that Eleanor planned to paint. A Heaven Room and a Hell Room based on her love of some of the mansions she visited when she was younger. However, while creating the demonic artwork that covered every inch of the Hell Room, she was overcome with a great sense of dread and unease. The Hell Room was later wallpapered over, leaving only one image uncovered. She called it the Golden Skull. The skeleton of a young child with beautiful golden hair. The Heaven Room was never started, but lies two rooms to the west. Oh, two rooms to the, to the west. So that bottom one there is the hell room, right? So this, the room with the clock in would be the heaven one? I think. Hmm. What did that lead to again? That secret room, I don't remember. Look at the map now. Okay. Oh, we've got more to do in the basement, surely. Oh, maybe we'll go down the lift. And that's how we'll get to the basement, if it doesn't burn. Right, let's hang out here. <laughs> I know that I didn't make the time go any differently. By reading that stuff, <laughs> it didn't pass any time, I mean, but that's okay. Oh! That wasn't who I expected it to be. <laughs> that was... Uh... That was not her. <laughs> that was four o'clock. That's when the smash happened. But she didn't fall through the window. Who is this? Their arm fell off. And there's no way in. But, right now... Oops. They must have fell off that balcony. Wait, what's above that balcony? The balcony is above... Is what's above there. So someone... Someone falls off there at four o'clock. I want to go and investigate that. Maybe the clock tower and the bell tower are two different things. But there's nowhere for them to fall from there. Hmm, that's not it. Okay, well... Don't need to wait around there any longer. Um, I'm gonna make my way to the casino now then. It's... Oh no, I'm not. I've done the thing. I'm going to the place. The bell is quite... The bell is... I guess the bell is above the casino. Right, so... That white checkered line... Is the balcony for the entrance hall. 
So those two squares at the bottom are above those two squares at the bottom. So the one on the right, the bell is above this room here. I think. So yeah, that's not the bell. So this stretch here, that's the balcony above this room that leads to outside but it didn't the body didn't come from there it came from above and i can't recognize who it was interesting no i've got to go back to the other place now i've gotten the way because i have set up so hopefully they shouldn't get burnt I assume he's going to do this as he goes past. At least now we've got this secret door. Wait, where am I right now? Down. No. Yeah, this way. This room's weird. So... This would be the heaven room if I read that right. Right, now none of them are green. The diamond hasn't changed yet, but he's got time. Yeah, for some reason my brain just automatically connected the bell tower and the clock tower as one thing. But that I guess you places might have a bell tower on its own without a clock on. Right, I've got a good feeling about this. Spades across the board. So in one hour, two hours, we will have found out. I think that's something else that's genius about the pacing of this game is because it's so fast. It's like so hectic and fast. You never win around for very long at all. And I don't know how they managed to achieve that because it's, it's a good fast. Like it's really... I'm really in awe of how they've made this game. Because the hurrying feels good. Like, it's not a stressful... It's a little bit stressful hurrying, but like... A fun stress rather than an actual stress. Alright, so here things should be different this time. No troubles. I mean, you forgot the one in the entry hallway, but I did it for you, so that's fine. I totally trust this person. They know what's going on. Well, they don't know what's going on, but they know something's going on. But at least they're not stupid. Here we go. Oh god. Moment of truth. The furnace, yep, yep. Furnace man. All been disconnected. An entirely new heating network. I'm glad you have so much faith. <laughs> Man. Oh no, what? Don't, no, 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 <laughs> oh, no. That wasn't the answer. Maybe I do need to turn them all on green. The thing 
thing is, I can't pick up that decapitated arm outside because that's what I wanted to use to attach to the other machine. Oh, Crafty's got ideas, perhaps. Ooh. Hmm. We haven't seen the furnace. What's going on? I'm making food and all I hear in the background is seven oh no's in a row. <laughs> well, Giraffe, I thought I'd solved it. But would you like some crispy Thanos? Oh. Aurum, whatever his name is. <laughs> she all know this guy to death. <laughs> oh shit. Well then, well, well then. This is getting more complicated. I'm going to the casino. <laughs> hmm. That gold mask man is very suspicious as well. Let me have a look. What's this on the map? Why have I got an exclamation mark here? Could be anything. There's so many exclamation marks. So yeah, I was just wanting to have a look at these portraits here. That's not the gold skulled man. The last silhouette. This one. So I think Aurum is the big guy and Thanos is the big hair. So I had them backwards. That's fine. Um, map, please. Map. So we go up and right. It's almost like they put a name in left to right order. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, let me get through here. We don't even know where... Ship. Where the fourth statue is, though, that's the problem. Like, we can't get out there until they're gone, so we just gotta chill here for a little bit. Is there any candles that we haven't. We've done that one in there. There's no candles down here. What is this? You see those gears in the middle? That's behind a curtain. If that's not the mechanics for the bell. The clock tower? Your standard suspicious mechanism required for every cult mansion. I should have known that. I've got one in my mansion. What the fuck am I talking about? Oh wait, I was still looking for candles. It looks suspicious suspiciously clock-like. <laughs> Easy for me to say. Um so we've just got an urn up there, which we might have done, but we've also got a chest up there and I wanted to go back up there anyway. So we are going to go back up there. And oh, I think I've got an idea what's going to happen. So once we've saved the final person, I bet we do have to save everyone, but we can transport through the mirrors so we can move around a lot quicker. And I, I really hope so, because that's fun as fuck. I really do hope we have to go around and save everyone in one day. Yeah, with the mirrors, it like, I felt like it was impossible if you're just doing it normal, but with the mirrors, you could really get around. You might need a full daily diary for that plan. Yeah, that's the issue, kind of. We'd have to really figure it out, but I'm totally up for that. I'm kind of excited to do that. 
I really like figuring that shit out. And I think I'd feel really accomplished for doing it. I hope Willow is okay. Let's get to the practice room. Okay, this is tequila. Yeah. Hmm. Casino. I need to go both to the casino and upstairs. Is this the entrance? Yeah, I think. Okay, we're in the casino. I've forgotten my way around here now. Right, we need to go down the service corridor. Oh. We've never been in the casino room and there's a card in there. So we can definitely get in there. Nice. Kind of want to see how many cards I've got. It does tell us in the pause menu. Fuck. <gasps> Did you see that? Someone just vanished through the mirror. Do you notice the mirrors are always in a door that you can't peep through? I've got this figured out. It's Cluedo. The mirrors are the secret passages. I'm so excited by this game. It's so good. What did that give us? Did we get anything for that? We got something here. Theatre Brutal. The Marquis Chambers. The Marquis had several offices that he used throughout the mansion, but his favourite was this room located close to the Theatre Brutal. He was always looking for new and interesting shows to host, building many bespoke stages along with his architect, Thanos Gorecki, Gorecki, for one of performances. In recent years, much of the original furniture from the room has been relocated but there are still many important personal touches to the room and secrets known only by the Marquis or those very close to him. It was also believed that this room was where he kept some of his most famous and important personal artifacts and treasures. So which room is this? This is in the theatre area. Theatre... Um, this is the theater area. I don't know which room that is. Hmm. It, when you say who crafty, it could have been one of the waiter guys because They've... Oh, no. Oh, shit. They've definitely appeared through there. Am I trapped? Oh, no. Oh, no. Let me through. <laughs> See ya. Okay. We did it. <laughs> I'm trying. Every time I pause, I keep trying to look at my cards. 34 out of 52. Hmm. That's not the most. But it's okay. Right, we've definitely... We've done that. That was how we saved the other person. See, this is... Right. Right. I'm just making an example here. We can teleport into this room with this mirror. Run along here. Change the camera so that he goes and saves her. So quick. And then we might make our way... Because we need to also turn the thing on. Then we'll probably make our way somewhere over here. 
that has another mirror somewhere. I don't know where they are. <laughs> but we'll figure that out. Right, now I need to go upstairs. If this isn't the case, I'm going to be so disappointed. <laughs> um. Oh, it won't let me go through there, will it? Where's... Where's the stairs? How do it? How do I normally get up the stairs? Wait, what? Oh, fuck. Ah! Run! Run me, run! Oh, we can hear her singing. Oh. Um. Oh, this is a secret door. But that's not... That leads us then down to the basement. Wherever that is. That leads us up those ladders. Up to... Somewhere that I don't remember. There is a simple staircase somewhere. Noob navigation. I normally get upstairs by lifting my feet one at a time. <laughs> oh no. Like, where are they? Oh, there they are. I'm on the wrong side of the bloody mansion. Ah. <sighs> We need a password to get through there. Oh no. We could also try and locate that Thanos during the day. Like, we'd have to track them backwards. Because we know what they do for the whole evening. But there could be some information that we're still missing. Quite the wild stairs here. We definitely need to turn them all green. Wait, where are the stairs? Gone the wrong way again. No. That's not the stairs I was looking for. Oh no, this is the stairs. I was going the right way. I was just in the wrong room. <laughs> oh, I know where they are now. Those are the other stairs at this side. I was looking for the OG stairs. I'll get there. So it's down and then along. There's a room between the spider room. It's this door. I didn't suspect it because it had a key pad on it. We're running out of time. But we shouldn't be this oh there's this is the key that we still don't know what it does. Key of old habit. And then when you read it, it just says opens a door or something. Oh no, it doesn't even say that. A heavy rusted key, it exudes menace. Right, which direction? Sorry for all the flicking back onto the map, by the way. <laughs> really sorry. Um Along and off, along and off. That key seems a bit dicey. 
<laughs> I like it. Right, this is the guy that's just disposed of tequila. So there shouldn't be anyone through here now. Let me through! Are you kidding me? How did... Oh, no. How... Oh, no. How did I get through here before? Let me in. The candle's back there. There's a candle in her bedroom. They won't talk to me now. I can go around lighting some of the candles now, though. That I know how. Well, maybe not now. See, this candle's already lit. There's a candle in here somewhere, right? It says. No. The room below. Yeah, I talked to them before. Just let me do it. I don't know if it's because I had the amulet. Maybe I need that. Oh, this is already on. Oh, that's right. That's the room with the fish body in. Like, there's no way I can do this in time. Oh, I can use the clock and do it tomorrow. Oh, God. There we go. If that doesn't work, I don't actually know. I don't know why I'm doing this, because there's not enough time. Let's just reset. Is it because she is dead now? You can't talk to them about seeing a dead lady. And weren't they trying to protect tequila and that's why they let me in? Let me just pick this up. Oh wait, we're following a ghost. Hi. You go rummaging around in a little... Oh. Things that a colossal put... Oh no. I, haven't... I don't know what you're saying, but I feel like you're a perv. Oh, oh. Shit. Shit! Oh my god, I'm surrounded. Again. Oh, Willow, sweetheart. I have to dash. You don't have a comb that I could borrow, do you? I'm the ghost like fangirling. Hey, keep your filthy hands to yourself. What? Stupid witch spoiling my fun. Oh, she's talking to the ghost. Ah, look at that. That's cool. Yeah, horny ghost again. And she was shouting at the ghost for get like perving on tequila. Well, at least she'll be safe. Little do you know, Willow. That's cool, we missed that before. So she thought she was like, keep your hands off my comb. Exactly, yeah. <laughs> That's what she thought. <laughs> okay, so this is when she goes and stands on the balcony for a bit. And talks about her, yeah. So we can get in there before she even gets there. Hopefully. Let me in! Oh! Oh, maybe I just didn't press the button properly. They're <laughs> just like, yes, yeah, sure. Go in. No problem at all here. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> I 
Yeah, I think I just pressed the button wrong. I think I pressed the X, but I didn't press it while it was on them or something. Yeah, I wanted to check in here. It must have just been a card that I got from there before. I could have checked the board. Hmm. Wasn't there a chest in here? Oh, that one's not outlined. Well, there is a candle in here. Oops. No! Get out! No! Run! No, please get out of my room. We're gonna have to wait until she's dead. Oh, it sounds like Mr. Sixpence has been taken care of. I hope two diamonds isn't much. I'm not there to clean it up or something. Let's set the scene. <sighs> oh, so delicate. Wait, what was this smash? That was it. This is the smash for the person that falls into the garden, right? So there's two smashes? Right, we need to get out of this room because they're gonna come in here when she dies. So we can be ready to go in here. But yeah, that was a different smash. And that's when the body lands in the garden, for sure. I just don't know where it falls from. The clock tower. Special. Right, so she's gonna get killed, but then we can talk to the ghosts. And if we can't, maybe we need to talk to them before she's killed? I don't know. Okay. Enjoy the performance. I was in your arms, crushing grip of steel. Once you had all my heart. Lord knows where that is now. Now I see through you as though you're made of glass. And it's too. Oh, here we go. I love this game. But isn't the vibes just like... How does it make so much vibes? Where does that actually lead down to? I know that they said she liked to be up here performing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so eloquent, as, as we all know. Oh, like, this is so sad, the music. Right, as soon as our flames go, we're going in there. We have got to remember how to save all the people. Well, hello indeed. Come to observe the talent as well, have we? She is such a star. The plunging neckline. The heaving bosom. You can keep that, actually. The real thing is so much more alluring. Oh, the invitation! Yeah, horny ghost number three. Get in. Jolly good show. <laughs> yeah, it was, wasn't it? <laughs> Jolly good show. The shows I put on in this mansion are always quite extraordinary, yeah. We can't climb up there to get a look. But we can now see... Oh, instrument pool room. Oh. The Marquis liked to say he blew so hard at playing most instruments, he almost literally sucked. <laughs> what? Okay. How 
However, he was an excellent pianist and a general audiophile. When, Al when Eleanor sang, the Marquis would frequently accompany her and playing together was one of their most cherished pastimes. Yeah, that is quite a phrase. <laughs> I really like it. <laughs> um, the instrument pool is a shallow ornamental pond surrounded by stone. Replicas of instruments played by some of the couple's favourite artists. And in the cabinets are instruments owned by famous musicians from history. Yeah. Every one of them is maintained and kept fully tuned. Any guest at the mansion who is happy to play for an audience is welcome to perform with any instrument they please. So that's very fancy. That is very fancy. Right, the guests. Tequila Bell. It was Tequila's invitation. Uh, we still don't have willows. I don't know how to get it yet. Uh, right, Tequila. The Southern Siren. Even throughout her extremely modest upbringing, Tequila Bell had a truly extraordinary voice. The Marquis had, a long, admi had long admired her as a performer and was staggered when he learned that she was a stepsister of Trinity Carrington. Ah, she's a stepsister. Okay. Since she was first invited, Tequila has attended and sung at every masked ball. Her usual accompanist, accompanist uh, is pianist Red Rockridge, but she and the Marquis would also practice together, sometimes long into the night. Although there was never any outward improperty, these sessions were eventually called to a halt by the Marquis shortly after he met his wife. Fair dues. Fair dues. So red... Okay. Red plays the piano for her. Everyone's connected here. <laughs> oh my, no more late instrument time. <laughs> Poor huge physical instrument. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh man. Well, we got that. That's sorted. I thought there was a chest up here, but it seems only her bosom was around. <laughs> Is there a chest up here? Mm. Oh, there's something in... Oh yeah, there is. There is that room there. Right, I know where to go. I'm scared he's gonna come through this door. Oh no, I've gone the wrong way. But we are also a pianist. Everyone here is a pianist. That guy didn't count? What? Did you see that? What is this guy's deal? You have your suspicions? Is he a ghost? He's gone through... He's gone through mir mirror... Well, he may not have gone through a mirror if he can just disappear. Right, this is where I was heading. <laughs> Okay, we got another card. Well, I'm trying to figure out a theory and I don't have one yet. What is that guy's deal? Okay, she's hanging there dead. We can't get her invitation from there. I wonder if her invitation can drop down there. I did open that chest. And yeah, I did. I did. I can't make it in time. It would be helpful if this door would open because now we know what's on the other side of it. 
where was I running to? The casino. I just kind of want to try being there at 7 p.m. Can I make it? Maybe I can. Quickly. Oh wait, I haven't opened it. Oh yeah, I have, but it'll be empty. See, this does look like it could be the bottom... The bottom of the bell tower, right? Nothing in there. We did this area. Okay. But now we've done all the clearing up that I wanted to do. Now all we've got left to do is figure out... How are we gonna save these people? Oh fuck, I'm here. I didn't mean to be here. Right, the first thing I need to do is head to these... The entrance hall, the library, something and something. I think we need to hear that conversation again. The chapel, didn't they say the chapel? And there's, look, there's a... There's a candle in there. But we have no way to get to there yet. Where would it be? Ludo, hello! How are you doing? How is it going? Were you playing The Last Guardian today? I hope you enjoyed. Welcome, everybody! Hope you're doing well. Thank you so much! Uh, we are playing the Sexy Brutal. We are... Hmm, I'm a little bit stuck at the moment, but if you see here, we have to go around saving all these people and we've got this far so far. So this is the, the people that we're on right now. Um, so if you want to like dip out before I spoil anything, that's totally fine. Because I highly recommend playing this game. It's like, it's a little bit puzzly, but it's also a little bit hectic. And it's a little bit, um, I don't even know how to describe it. It is puzzly and explorey as well. Um, you did more than four hours of The Last Guardian. Oh, was it as good as the first time you played it? I still haven't played it myself. I don't know if I want to. I think it'll make me cry. <laughs> no worries, kind of want to see what this game is about before you figure out if you want to avoid spoilers. Do you want me to give you a, a brief um, overview? <laughs> Basically, we're at this mansion and how do I do this? So time passes pretty quickly. You can see in the bottom corner, we've got this stopwatch and when it gets to midnight, the day resets and we've got to try and save these people that all die in different ways. And we've got to figure out how to save them. Um, and it might take a few days, well, a few loops to figure it out. Um, and a lot of the game is just running around this mansion, finding all of the weird shit and figuring out how to save them. Unfortunately, I haven't figured out how to save... I've kind of figured something out, but I don't know exactly what yet. But um, each person that you save unlocks new abilities and grants you access to more of the mansion. And then you will have to backtrack to get collectibles and stuff. Is a bit like Majora's Mask. I don't know. I haven't played that. Uh, oh, Crafty has the similarities for sure. It's 
it's very fast paced. I will I will play some gameplay as soon as I figure out what I was actually doing because I've forgotten. <laughs> um, Last Guardian is really frustrating to actually play but gets really emotional in parts. Yeah. Uh, except if you hit the final limit, the game sends you back. You don't get bonked on the head by the moon. <laughs> Um, thankfully I don't- I've never been bonked on the head by the moon. And like, you expand your map and once you figure out where people are, it'll add them to your map and like, you can see where they are at what time and stuff. It's very well done. Like, I'm in love with this game. But where am I? And where am I going? And... Where did I come from? <laughs> I'm lost. I think I'm actually lost. Oh, there I am, there I am. Right. I found... I found me! Okay, I think I need to go this way. <laughs> the map feature is super vital, it's really good. Yeah. Super vital. Especially for what I assume is gonna happen. Which may not happen, but what I think is gonna happen. And like you can choose different points where to spawn in. You lose certain items. So like every time I restart a game, I lose that key. I still haven't figured out what it's for. Crafty, I am always caught Nigel. <laughs> Didn't you know? <laughs> okay, um, we need to go. I'm lost again. I keep losing myself. Okay. Also, we can't be seen. Um, so there's like a tiny bit of stealth, but it's not really bad. You can look through, like you can peek through doors before you go to listen to what people are saying. Um, but there's no consequence really. As long as you fast and get out of people's way, it's fine. I'm actually gonna... Um... I'm gonna re-checkpoint to here because I don't need to be up those stairs anymore. Um, and there's this like little puzzle mechanic. Like these rooms feel Resident evil -y to me because like we've got these like puzzly bits and the like mansion. <laughs> this does look, it might be up your alley. You think you'll wishlist it. I highly, highly recommend. Um, I've had so much fun so far. I've gone the wrong way. <laughs> and yeah, you don't start off with this big map. You kind of unlock it as you go, which is really satisfying because you figure out... Um, this is green. Because you figure out, like, kind of by heart where to go. Except, like, you can't go through these fiery doors, so you have to reroute and stuff like that. And I feel like this is going to be a door. Like, why else would it be there? <laughs> but we haven't unlocked it yet. I mean, the best thing I can think to do right now for my current situation is fix these rolly things. And like, you can hide in cupboards so you can spy on what people are saying. Also, those audio cues are things happening in other parts of the mansion. So like, that gunshot has a significance. Um, It's very, very well made. It does sound like a Spock game, nice. Uh, when you think of video game mansion exploration, you think of old... something game you played when you were an alien exploring a haunted mansion and solving alge alge <laughs> algebra problems. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> algebra <laughs> problems. I don't know what that game is. Oh, edutainment game. Is that like an education entertainment game? I've never heard that word, but that's really clever. <laughs> I figured it out at the same time as I got a definition. <laughs> right, so I need to go down. See here, there's someone in here. And I can listen to them talking. And watch where they're going. But I can't actually go in there because I don't. I need to go around. And my mask sets on fire whenever I'm gonna accidentally walk in on someone. 
What is up here? The library. Hmm. Have I really explored up there? I have more exploring to do up here because I need to turn this clock on. It was part of the Math Blaster series. I should play those. <laughs> My maths is not good. So yeah, we've got this. We've been here. This is locked. And I can't see through it. Oh, this is the secret. Right, this is the secret door. <laughs> New maths blaster. <laughs> yeah. Is that not the shelf that opened the door into this place? Yeah, that's that's on the other side of this thing. <laughs> well, I'm missing something in this area. 100%. I never noticed if the keys end up on the map. I don't think they do. I'm not seeing it in here. But like... Are these pins in the wrong way? Because, like, they're not actually facing each other, like it says, you know? But I can't interact with them, so what can I do? Uh, like, this game, I would say, when you start it, it seems a bit overwhelming with all the prompts that keep coming up and stuff, but it all really starts to come together and make sense. And it's got such a vibe. Now I'm just exploring pointlessly. Oh, and that leads up to there, right? Hmm. And I don't think I missed anything up there. Can't believe I got stuck. Well, I can't believe it. They keep you quite a bit more linear at the start. Yeah, it does a good job of introducing you in. Like, the tutorial is just kind of uh, like a tip of the iceberg of what you do. And then gradually things get more... I'm sorry for clicking on the map all the time. Gradually things open up more. Right, that's... So I'm going right, right, down. Hopefully there's no one here because I never check the doors before I go through them anymore. But I feel like every room's got its own little secret. Have we ever found anything that could be an arm? A statue of a knight, but the arm is missing. You know what? That's... I did actually want to check the other ones, what their arms look like. Because that would help, knowing what I'm looking for. Oh no. That's what happens if you go in a room with someone. Oh, they've gone into... Oh, if I... Oh no. I thought they'd gone into there. So I was like, if I'd opened that, I could be spying on that now. I think I do need to spend a day spying through that spy hole. Don't come this way, please. Okay. Unfortunately, this guy's on his way to his doom because I haven't figured out how to help him yet. Uh... This also reminds you of those plays that take place in buildings where people are encouraged to attend multiple times to see what's going on at different times in different rooms. Oh my god, that sounds like fun. <laughs> Never been to one, but have always sounded interesting. That's exactly what this is like, yeah? Like, that. this is that in game form, like 100%. Why can't I find... Here we go. So what does this arm actually look like? It's just a metal arm. It's literally an arm. The statue's arm is locked in place and cannot be moved. We have not... Oh, I mean, we're too late anyway. 
Can we break it off? No. I'm so sad to admit that I'm... I'm really getting stuck. <laughs> that is a mystery. I don't know where your card went, buddy. This is when I'm really starting to be puzzled. I might as well just go back into the big library room. So we checked all of these. There was nothing like useful anywhere. I don't see a key. We did this. We checked all of these things. That's a one-way door to the other way. Yeah. We checked all this out. God damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. We didn't do much exploring up this end of the world. I'm a little bit... I didn't just kill more people. I didn't do it. It wasn't me. <laughs> Through inaction. <laughs> That's so noob. <laughs> no. <laughs> How's the totally not me murdering going? No. Days like this, I wish we were less competent. <sighs> I wish I was more competent on days like this, I've got to admit. Okay, this is the casino. <sighs> Wait, did we. What's in here again? This is another one of those secret doors. Wait, that just leads into the bar? Really? I don't... Hmm. Let's check that out. Also, keep an eye out for any arms. But this makes me think we've, we've missed an area because we're also missing a statue. So basically what the map tells me is the door leads to here. You see that? But it's locked. Hmm, there's something weird about this. Oh no, oh no. Go away! Where is he, where is he heading this way? I need to turn this music off. Maybe he would be saying something useful here. Okay, I've got an idea. I might even reset the day right now and do that now. Because I don't have many other ideas. And we haven't really stalked him that much. Right, yeah, that's what I'm doing. Turn the music off. I think he's going to have some information. Is that the door the arm pulling guy uses? The arm pulling guy. I don't think so. It doesn't seem to be a real door. How did I get there? Run! Fake doors, once again, the greatest enemy. Always. We can also light... Okay. We can light this. So we can also listen to the ghosts. I 
what time does he enter this room? It's gotta be soon. Here we go. Man, I never get tired of seeing this messed up creepy bar. That is a large, large man. I don't care how big he is. He doesn't know the password. He's not sent for into this club. I need to know that password. Wait, shut up you two. Is that? Aurum runes, yeah. I can spot your handy. Oh, we've heard this before. So the ghosts of fangirling. If he doesn't know the password, please tell him the password. Hey, hey, hey! Yes. Oh. Woo! I love solving puzzles. <laughs> that was a noise of joy. <laughs> Wait, is he gone? I know the password, dude. Let me in. Eleanor, very good. Yes. Who cares about murder when you can start a nightclub? Yeah, you are being very good with the quotes today. Oh, this is... Oh, there's the final thing. There's a ghost party going on in here, like, they are jamming. Okay, so we can... So we do need to find an arm. I've got an idea. I've got a new, a new idea. Maybe he breaks the arm off, so we need to go there first thing. Big brain. Hey! Absolute ghost party. Yeah, I've only just thought of that, Crafty. <laughs> the acoustics in this room must be extraordinary. Let me just check. So there's one more room here and we know he's in that room. Right, we know how to solve this thing now. You know the term, the brown note? I invented that. I don't know the term. The IP room to have its own corner bar. The drinks look less poisonous than in the other room. A proper shindig. Wait, a who to nanny? Perhaps it's a full-blown barnstormer. What? I was passed over for first saxophone. I did see a saxophone lying around outside. Just wrecking shit. Jack of diamonds. Oh, he's coming. Oh no, wait. I just got close to the door. Oh. Oh. Run. Run me, run. I wanted to get in the cupboard. Oh, I'll get in this cupboard. So we could have listened to a conversation there. With all the quotes, you could say I'm quite the... Cutie? <laughs> Wait, what? Are you calling yourself a cutie in a pun? <laughs> Friend, are you coming? I know that you're gonna have to go to your death one more time, but we just solved something without Google, and I'm really excited that we might be able to complete this entire game without Google. Okay. I mean, there's certainly a party going on somewhere in here. There's, I think there's multiple parties going on in here, actually. Are you saying giraffes are not cute, new? No, I never said that! <laughs> of course giraffes are cute. You're the cutest giraffe. <laughs> um so we just Oh, if I'd realized this was a cupboard, we might have been okay. <laughs> right, never mind. Did we talk to those other ghosts? I don't think we did. 
If there's one thing the Sexy Brutal has in spades, it's bars. No one goes thirsty here. It's a good observation. Oh, and then this leads back to the stairs that I couldn't find earlier. Do you know what? I've just noticed a thing. You see that rug at the bottom of the stairs? And it's kind of like a fan shape. That's the kind of symbol that was on that door to that hut that we've seen outside with the lady in. You see? You are hoping the other thing you wondered about this setup might come into action. Oh, I wonder what that is. <laughs> Fantastic. That was a good observation though, right? I'm proud of myself. Found something very interesting on a large gentleman who passed through here. You have nothing to trade for it, so I'm keeping it. Oh, is it the arm? Or is it the invitation? Trade? This music? If you can offer me something suitably grisly for my costume, I will trade you whatever I found, deal. Something grisly. You assumed invitation. Yeah, it's gonna be the invitation. The band plays on no matter what and no matter when. The band always plays. Something suitably grisly. Hmm. Deal, but I don't... Let's have a think. The charm? Where is it? The charm from up here? I won't I call it grizzly. What kind of thing would be grizzly? Right, I need to reactivate the clock down here, Donna. Because I need to start and I need to head straight for that one. Yeah. So hopefully I can make my way down there on time. Well, you sucked some blood out of some fish with it. That was quite grisly. <laughs> that is true. Oh, grizzly. <laughs> um, this way. Grizzly bears eat fish. That was an intentional troll. I I accept. I can't rescue this one anyway, but still. This is seeming more and more complicated though, if my theory is right and we do have to save everyone in one day. That's gonna be hectic. I've got a feeling I'm gonna be disappointed. That's not gonna happen. Right, I'm nearly there. I'm nearly there. Right, we're ready for tomorrow where we're gonna save these people. Finally. We've got all the pieces in place. There's definitely still a chapel area to, um... Oh no. Rip. That's... Oh look, we had three on. Okay, let's reset. We're doing it, we're doing it. Just do exactly what we just did, except... Differently. <laughs> we do this one first. Okay, we've got this. I think. Um, am I going the right way? This is the hell room. Oh, it's got a... Right, I know I don't really have time. But look. 
It's got a Mona Lisa with three eyes. <laughs> oh, fuck. No. No. He's sabotaging it. One, change the symbol. <gasps> Two, break the arm off. No. Right, we've got to follow this guy and see where he puts it. Sentence the meddlers to a fiery death. If they try trespassing! Days like this, it's good to be alive. Right, we need to follow him. We're stalking. Control Alt Snoop is back. I'm excited. Oh no, where's he gone? Right, he's gone left. He's gone right. Oh god, we're gonna lose him. He's going in there! Oh, we need to open them curtains! Or maybe it's in there and I didn't notice. It seems we will not be saving anyone today! <laughs> no! Frig! Alright, so... I need to run straight to this room. <laughs> so instead of going down, I need to go up. <laughs> but that's fine. We can do that. I might restart the day again. <laughs> right, we, today is the day that we save, every, well, these two. These two guys. <laughs> okay. Oh, up and right. Up and right. Through the devil's waiting room. Through here. Fuck. No, no, no. There he goes to break the arm off. Little sabotage. -er. I'm also glad they didn't even put a limit on how many times you can get caught in a day or something. Like, I much prefer it the way they've done it. So now we're gonna see what he does with the arm. We do need to quickly get out of here. Oh god, I don't like that noise. Hopefully no one comes in here while we win. <laughs> we need to quickly get our walks longest, slowest way all the way around the room. <laughs> I wanted to check if there was anything I could interact with. Look at him carrying that arm. I can't believe we never caught him before. Can't believe I thought I was stuck. Like I'm on to you, number three. Right, let's see what you're doing here. Open this up. Aha! This hides here, does it? Who uses a dumb waiter these days? You're a dumb waiter. A dumb restaurant owner. My joke was better. <laughs> God, I'm tired. <laughs> Ooh, back to it then. Even if he did know the statues, all need to be hearts. That old fossil wouldn't be able to do anything about it now anyway. Haha. -ha. Right, I think I might be too late. I think. We need to reset the day another time. <laughs> but... No, no, there's no way we... Right, no, because we could go and do the other ones first and now we could come and get that on the way back now that we know where it is, right? Hearts now, so many lies. What do you mean? 
Okay. Uh, I like how he just did an audible yawn as soon as I started yawning. I mean, they are contagious, right? First it was spades, then it was green. Green? I'm so confused. <laughs> oh, wait. Hearts. Hearts go green. Hearts go green. So yeah, we do need to put it on hearts. Yeah. He said... If, even if they knew that they need to be on all hearts, they can't do anything about it anyway. He was just reciting the plan to himself, basically. He's turned them all off hearts now. They think it has to be spades anyway, so like... Yes. I wonder if I get to keep this. Right, let's see if I can run around and do the other ones on time. I don't think we're going to be able to, but we can try. This is tense. It's in this room, I think. Yeah. Right, uh huh. Entrance hall. So this way we go. Frig, that, that exclamation mark's in my way. <laughs> All right, we go up and right and down. Yeah, yeah, up. Right. Do you know what else I really like about this setup? Like, each room is just... Oh, fuck. Oh, this one's already green. This one must just stay green already. <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake. We could have done it. Right, no, we need to go up. We need to wait for him to leave. Here we go. Oh, you still gotta change that other one, but that's fine. I can change it back. We got this. Maybe? I could be too late here, actually. This is the first one we need to do. Oh, let me in! Let me in! No! Okay. This is where we start next time when we fail this time. I kind of thought that this would just be open for us now. look up and see the green and think oh green that must be right it's better than the danger red we need something grizzly for this ghost right two more to go and they're on the way there we've got one hour to do it <laughs> this is tense Sprint for your life. Well, not for your life, but for their lives. For the sake of the people. Oh, god damn it. For the people, Laffy. That'll be this one, right? Yeah, go. For the people! Ah! <laughs> it's getting so close! Right, which way is it? Which way? Right, right. 
Run! Run! Let's get the arm ready. Pull it! No! Why is it locked in place? Let me pull it! I think I was too late. How did he put it onto spades if you kept the arm? Yeah, I never changed it either. The little man put it onto spades and then snapped the arm off so it couldn't be changed back. <laughs> oh, I'm so upset, but I know what to do. And actually, it might be better if I start from this clock. I'm gonna go and reset to the other clock. Because then I can go straight up to the party. I'm not going to be keeping the arm. I'm going to have to do the arm each time, I think. Unless it's fixed now, but I doubt it. That wouldn't make any sense. I'm so curious about this clock that we haven't done. You would have had time for sure. What do you mean? <laughs> Run! I would have had time if I didn't come here, actually, wouldn't I? Good night, cruel world. So we know we need to turn the record off straight away and light the candle as well. It was time in the day, just fitting a few more things in a little earlier. We should be able to go straight in and get the arm now, I would think. Because we know where it is as well. Whereas before we had to wait for the guy to leave, but as he leaves, fuck, he gets that conversation. Oh, so this is where they start their day. Yeah. So we have seen their entire day. You know what? Uh, never mind. <laughs> Wait, did I just stop talking? Because <laughs> if I did, I did not know it. <laughs> right, hurry up, people. There's no time for chatting. Oh no, don't you go in there. He goes straight in there. Oh, that means I need to be in the casino clock. We are going to save these two, I promise. Even if it kills me. There's no other way to get through there. Is... Oh my god, there was totally another way to get through there. I'm an idiot. There was another way. Funny how this one... One round is taken... Alright, Raz! There's no need! How this one round has taken almost as long as your whole last stream at this rate. Is this got more complicated? There may have been another way. Ross is like, it's this way! <laughs> yeah. Right, I'm starting again. I know what I'm doing. It's, this is the time. I can feel it. This is the time we save these two. Okay, I'm sweating. <laughs> right, music, goodbye. Later, hello. I still feel really clever for solving this part of the puzzle, even if it did take me a year. 
Right, let me in. Quickly. Oh, right. Oh, no. I've just had a thought. Oh, shite. I just had a thought. We can't do this until he's done it. Because he's just going to change it back. So I didn't need to reset. <laughs> no. Oh. <laughs> You're way ahead of me, Crafty. I don't think of these solutions till I've encountered the problem. <laughs> God damn it. I was like, if we can get there first, we can we can knock one away and then what we actually have to do is follow him. I get it now. <laughs> Oh. Frig. You have one more thought we will see. See, now I'm trying to see how it all goes. We don't have to go to the entry hall. He's now going to go in there and have a chat for a bit, which I'm going to listen to. Oh, wait, he might do it now, which would be ideal. And then he goes in there for a chat. And then I can go and bugger off and do the other ones. Alright. Hopefully he doesn't notice when he walks back through. I do kind of want to listen in though as well. Spades is the furthest one away from her. Always. I don't have time for this. Right, they're talking about being famous. We gotta run. Please don't notice that it's changed on your way out. If we can... Right, so we can try and do the other one, but then we're still going to have to double back and get the other one. Because he changes this one on the way. Frickin' hell. But that's fine, because we now have time to go to the banquet room. I think we've got it this turn. Oh, except for this big long conversation that goes on in here every time. Oh, they're done. Sweet. So we got some stuff done. Last time we couldn't do anything until after this. Brilliant timing. Get the arm. Okay, can we sprint? It's kind of cool how it locks you into the animation because it makes you panic a little bit in case anyone's going to come in through the door. So we can do this one now. And then head back to the other one. Although he might change it, I don't know. You know how he's saying he did what he asked him to do, right? He forgot the one in the entry hall and he clearly didn't do this one because it was broken. So he's kind of a liar too. <laughs> he only did two out of the... Out of the four. And then he just went and had a drink instead. Where am I heading? Where am I heading? Oh. Oh god. That noise usually means something... Some masked person somewhere. Right, we basically need to hide in these rooms now.
Hide in here until he passes through. Which should be soon. Is this him? Hey! This is this is as if it was meant to be. And he nearly missed this one, so he only went to do one. <laughs> This guy, this guy. All right, now, oh no, now we've got the rush on again. Oh, yes! He didn't change the other ones. Yes! Woohoo! Oh no, don't skip all the text, you stupid game! Oh no. Oh, it's fine, we've already read this, right? Well, it's too terrible to imagine what could have happened. What? I'm feeling better than I thought I would. Maybe I don't need this mask on right now. Yes, I feel a weight has been lifted. Ah. Oh. Friends? Do you have a mask there that I could maybe borrow? Ah, Boone. Laffy, how are you, man? Did you... Did you do something with the elevator here? I had the most terrible feeling. Boone, would you mind terribly... Con would you mind terribly continuing our search for Lucas? I mean, I have been terribly searching for things recently. I'm worried about him, but he is least likely to be offended when the concern is coming from you. That boy loves you, Laffy. Looks up to you, you know? Even with all his crazy riches, he still has a soul needs saving. Plus, this old fool here owes me a drink. Everyone's just going to drink when I save them and leaving me to do all the dirty work. And some staff members an apology. There will be zero apologizing. The sass on that young man. I tell you, in my day. Okay. Again, I don't think that's the way to the bar. We did it. We did it. Woo! Thanos' mask is yours, Boone. Ha! <laughs> Viva la revolution, bitches! <laughs> Perfect, Giraffe. Right, Thanos Architect Insight. The genius architect Thanos Garok had an unparalleled knowledge of the sexy brutal visiting certain areas of the mansion will trigger memories and reveal secrets unlock new entries in the brochure by using the power when the prompt appears Ooh, collectible hunting i guess kind of he knows more about this place than any man except perhaps for reggie the mirrors the mirrors the mirrors the mirrors Thanos Monument is your path forward, but he can also reveal so much about the mansion and the path you've already taken. You've opened a path downward, Boone. I want to thank you. There is something so precious down there in the dark. Come to find me. Right, so I feel like this is telling me do everything you want to do now because it's a point of no return. Your voice level and thing just did a lot of work. <laughs> Very successfully? Nice. No, I didn't want to go down yet. No, game. Okay. Hopefully we can go back up. We'll re reset. Saturday once again. Basement. Maybe we can't get back up. The elevator is a work of art, it appears 
to be wrought from pure gold with one of the finest examples of a clockwork lift mechanism you could imagine. But it to be hidden down here is a selfish crime. Right, I apologize that I'm streaming for longer tonight, but I definitely want to finish this game tonight. So I think I'm just going to have a quick pee break. Okay. Um. Oh, and we get to use the mask when we come back. So I am just going to go on. Everyone go for a pee break. A pee pee break. I've forgotten what we were confusing pee with earlier. But this one is a legit pee break. So I will peep. <laughs> Quick peep break. Everyone go and peep on someone. Never peep on someone. I didn't say that. Are you going to pause the game or let all the time run away? Shite. Yeah, good, good point. Good, very good point. <laughs>